Go, go. Yo, what's good, YouTube? Me, I tune in to Get Hip TV. As y'all can see from the title, we got Wack 100 speaking on Bosco 100 after something that he said to Loose Cannon. So, man, we're gonna get into that, then I'm gonna let y'all hear what Wack had to say. So, man, stay tuned for that. But before we get into the video, make sure you smash that like button, subscribe, and hit that notification bell to stay hip to whenever I post. But, all right, y'all, let's get into it. So Bosco 100 was speaking to Loose Cannon and said that the last person that whooped him didn't make it to do an interview. So Wack 100 called Bosco out on this and felt like he was taking credit for something that he didn't do. So man, I'ma roll the audio and I'ma let y'all hear it. Yeah, this is bad work. This is, this is bad work. This, this right here is for the finish him, Bobby. He all wet. His ass been a clown. Mm -mm. If you want to, who got who got audio on here? I could put my audio on. Give me a second. Did he take? Day to day. Well, they finna roast more on that shit. Cause I let this shit. I did text it to you. Okay. Play that content. Um, whatever media team it is, you better catch it. So I already up on my ID. You better grab it. That nigga is now claiming he the one did something to Rosemo 700 on the phone with Loose Cannon earlier today. You let your mouth overload your ass. They finna max your ass out, boy. You about to get maxed out. Bad work. You niggas get beside yourself on them phones. The last nigga whooped my ass hey, two days later. He talking about Rosemont 700. Now you know you ain't did that shit, but now you want to claim it because you talking to a crip nigga. Boy, when them niggas hear that shit, they going to the dog out of that boy. Who cared about that dude, man? It's... That... I'm going to play it one more time for the media team and for the people that didn't catch it. See if you could turn it up a little bit. Like, 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 damn, it's a big old nigga. You just no intimidation, bro. I, I, bro, I'm going to run. Bro, so you, you know I'm going to get the shit out of you. You know I'm going to get the shit out of you. Like, like, bro, I'm looking forward to it. Come to my ass, bro. You know what? Let me to do what ain't nobody else been able to. Last nigga that whooped my ass. Boy, 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 treacherous. Boy, How they many niggas beat his ass. It, no, it's only one nigga. It's the nigga named Rosemo 700 from Neighborhood Power Rope. When they hear that nigga say that, they gon' they on his ass. Ain't no getting away. <laughs> that nigga had Bosco running up and down the street. That's your ass, Mister Post. Yeah, boy, you know, as soon as they hear that shit, shit, bro. Soon as they hear that nigga, you tell it the rolling sixties, some shit like that. And that's fresh. That ain't no. That's right now. Yo, boy. Hold on. That shit did damn near went five thousand times on my goddamn. And it been and it been replayed twenty five hundred times on my reels in a matter of eight minutes. Yeah. Jesus. See, I let it go tonight. By the time them niggas wake up, it's gonna be the circulated real, real, real good. <laughs> I 
diabolical. <laughs> I be leaving them alone till they be playing. Nigga, by the time I get up in the morning, that shit is going to go crazy. So when y'all put it up, send me the link. I'm going to put it in my story with all y'all links. It's not like we didn't see how that whole thing went out on the internet, too. So he's talking crazy. Yeah, but the fact that he's saying it like that. It's been a bad work week. God damn, why on my birthday week? Boy, they over here. Mm-hmm. Go viral again. He smelled like a nigga. <laughs> Who just said that? That was crazy. <laughs> <laughs> smelling like a nigga is insane. What? I never smelled that before. <laughs> Thank God. <laughs> it's spread. That shit. Well, by the time, nigga, look, by the time, see, tonight, niggas is going to after parties, BET after parties, niggas is tapping shoulders. Blood, you seen this shit? Blood, you seen this shit? Blood, you seen this shit? Boy, by between the hours of 8 a.m. and noon tomorrow, that. Go, that nigga better be driving the main nigga in the undercover Hertz rental. Hey, wasn't the motorcycle function out there this weekend too? It's always Red Bree weekend. That's what I'm saying. That shit spread like wildfire. Oh, like wild, yeah. Nah, Bosco been a. Yeah, that's bad work though. That that okay. Tink, Tink, let me tell you what you're looking at. Right? Let me tell you what you're dealing with. Right there, you dealing with a nigga got into it with King Vine. Right? And coincidentally, two days later, King Vine get killed. Right? On some whole other shit. Years go by, and that nigga that got into it with King Vine is now saying... Nigga, you see what happened to the nigga two days later after I got into it with the nigga. What you think that's about? He claiming it. Oh, you're a goofy. You know how it's finna go. That's what yeah, that yeah. is. Yeah. That's what you listening to, right? Yeah. Yeah. You, <laughs> you setting yourself up for that business right there. Nigga that whole, oh, wait, nigga, hold on. We know you didn't do that, but now you want to tell some enemies? Yeah. You did yeah. that? Yeah. That's like that's like Vaughn's side going to Lil Tim's side and telling them what the f- going on or vice versa. Mm-hmm. Yeah. But but he really didn't do it. But now he claiming it. He claiming it to an enemy. Loose Cannon neighborhood and that neighborhood is enemies. All right, man. So as y'all heard from that, that's what Wack One Hundred had to say about Bosco after speaking with Loose Cannon. So, man, I want to get y'all thoughts and opinions on that down in the comment section below. And if y'all enjoyed this video, make sure y'all smash the like button, subscribe if you're new, and hit that notification bell to stay hip to whenever I post. Till next time, we out.